So this week I have the entire week off work from my day job, which means I can live my perfect life of just being, doing my art for a whole week. But it's quite good that I have this week off actually because I, because I decided that I'm going to try selling my work in a local gallery in May. So, and I really want to make some new work for it. I want to do some new postcards. So this week I'm going to be working on that. I'm actually going to try outsourcing them because I've been thinking about outsourcing prints and stuff for a while. Usually I would just print them myself at home, but I really want to try doing proper thick, luscious postcard prints. So that's what I'm going to be working on this week. And I have some sample packs because like, I don't know if you know this, but if you just go to like most printing companies and request a sample pack, they'll just send you a sample pack for free. So I just need to have a little see about the prices on those. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm going to end up going with Moo because people have also um, recommended them to me, but it's good to have a look at other places just in case you can get a better deal. I really want to do five different designs because on Moo you can have, you can buy 50 prints but they can be however many different designs as you want so it really is more economical to buy 50 prints with five designs than to buy 10 of each print of five designs if that makes sense. I hope that makes sense. So I want to do five different designs which means I need to be banging out like one or two a day because I really want to get them ordered this weekend because I don't know how long they're going to take to get here. Um, so I did a few designs in my sketchbook, which I'll show you. So I did these designs. The theme is spring. It's in May and the theme is spring. So it's, and I want to sell on my Etsy anything that doesn't get sold in the gallery. So it's kind of, I'm trying to maintain the theme of spring, but not make it too springy because then when stuff comes back to me, I'm going to be selling that in June, which is summertime. So I'm trying to get a nice balance between could be spring, could be summer, basically just colorful nature plant, lovely, pretty, nice. So today I'm going to mostly focus on the bee drawing because I can't think of any other really designs that I want to do. I was going to spend the rest of the time sketching until I had five designs and then I was just going to paint them all but I think I'm just going to get stuck in with the B one because that's strong. I know what I want to do with it. So I need to cut down some watercolour paper. I need to do the sketch for the B painting which I'll do off camera and yeah then we can get into painting. I also need to photograph some new paintings so busy day today but it's going to be fun so let's go.
so I finished this guy. I don't know if I like it. <laughs> Isn't that always the way though? Um, yeah, I wasn't, uh, I made the paint, I mixed the paint too thin for the lines initially. So some of the lines are really, really dodgy. So I'm going to need to go over them in the computer anyway. But I think I might fuss with the composition because I actually think the B is potentially a little too far up. I think potentially it needs moving down more of the yellow background. So yeah, mm, not sure about it. I do think it's cute. I just think maybe it needs a little bit of work, but that's all right. That's why, um, that's why we have computers and graphics tablets. So yeah, so I don't want to look at the B for a little bit. So, <laughs> so I'm going to leave the B and I'm going to start working on another painting maybe this guy i don't know if you can see you probably can oh yeah you can a little bit it's just a little deer and i also did a mouse actually maybe i'll work on the mouse today we all know i love a rodent so but yeah i woke up feeling really good this morning and feeling like i was gonna get a bunch of work done and now i don't feel so great about um about the bee Oh. Do you know what it is? I swear to God, it's because I'm making these to be prints. Because I'm, it's because I'm not just like, I'll just do some paintings. If I was just like doing some paintings, they would be, they would be great. But because I'm like, I'm gonna make these for prints for the gallery that I'm, that I'm gonna be paying money to go in. <laughs> uh. I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> oh.
Hello again. It's Thursday now. I am wearing the same jumper I was wearing yesterday. And that's fine. Anyway, so yesterday I finished this little guy. And then just now I finished this little guy. And I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about the colours. I feel like the pink deer looks a bit weird. The yellow mouse looks a bit weird. I feel like I was trying to like just give myself a really basic colour palette so that everything went together and because that's usually how I'm most comfortable working. But I don't think it's really gone in my favour this time. But all is not lost um, because I do not want to have to paint these again. So I think what I'm going to try and do is take them into the computer and switch the colours. Hopefully it'll work. But we'll see. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I'm going to spend the rest of the day doing. Ooh. Um, yeah, but I'm ultimately... As paintings, I'm very happy with them. Um, it's just it's just the colours are... I'm not sure. Maybe I've been looking at them for too long. Maybe if I like step away for a second, come back, they'll be okay. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have some lunch. And then I'm going to scan them and put them into the computer and everything. It's now 10 to 11. I've been working since like nine, half eight, nine, something like that. So there's been a couple of hours of um, just test prints. So <laughs> I managed to edit the paintings that I did yesterday because I really wasn't as I, I'm sure you remember me saying, I really wasn't into the pink deer or the bright yellow mouse. Um, still not into the bright yellow mouse. I'm more into the pink deer, but I just think he's too pink. So last night I ended up sort of making the mouse and the deer a similar color, which was kind of like an orangey brownish color. Because I thought that would look nicer. Way too dark on the mouse. Looks okay on the deer. But then when I came in this morning and looked at them again after sleeping on it. I actually really liked the pink deer. Um, I just think it needed toning down a little bit. And the mouse was for sure too freaking dark. So... I ended up keeping the deer quite pink and then the mouse I just kind of lightened him up and muted the colour a little bit more. So they kind of, they still go together but I think they look a bit better now. I'm much happier with them than I was yesterday after I painted them. In fact I was panicking a little bit after I painted them yesterday because I was like, I don't think these are good. <laughs> So I've been test printing all morning trying to get the colours right. I also couldn't decide, because I'm definitely going with Moo by the way, couldn't decide between the A6 postcard and the medium postcard. It's a fun life, it's a fun life and I am literally so indecisive about this. It's not 
it's not cool. <laughs> um, but other than that, I want to, I still want to do two more paintings. Um, but I'm just going to do some flower paintings. I'm going to use some photos I've taken recently of some pretty flowers. And I'm going to paint those so that I have a set of five. Um, and then I can get ten of each printed. So that's what I'm going to do today.
Hi, it's a bit late now, it's Sunday. Today was the last day that I wanted to spend on these paintings. Um, it's actually taking me way longer than I thought it would to paint. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, Saturday and Sunday usually um, are like job stays, if you know what I mean. So I end up having to do a lot of cooking, I have to do the grocery shopping and yeah so the fact that i actually managed to get two paintings done in that time was actually pretty good so so i managed to get these done which i really like actually i think they're really cute um they're quite cute as a little pair yeah i really like them i don't know i might like them more than the animal paintings that i do <laughs> which is a bit annoying because like animals are like my thing you know what i mean I've got the uh, I've got the Sunday sads today because I've just had this whole week off of work, basically living my best life and doing exactly what I want to do all day for a week, well for ten days, and I'm back at work tomorrow. <sighs> I know. I mean, I just want to clarify. I don't hate my job. I like my job. I get paid to do something that I don't mind doing. Like I've had much worse jobs. I've worked in customer service and retail and I would not go back to them. Certainly I enjoy having a creative job now. I'm a graphic designer in case you didn't know. Um, but it's not, I feel so ungrateful saying this, but it's just not what I want to do forever. I want to do my illustrations. So I feel quite sad about going back to work and I feel kind of guilty about that because I know there are people who do not have jobs or have jobs that are way worse than mine. <sighs> but can't help feeling what I feels. So I just need to scan these in, edit them, put them in a template and then put them all in the template for moo.com and then upload them and oh shh, uh, I also need to do the back because I want to put my information on the back of each print and I want to get it finished today and it's quarter to three so <sighs> although to be fair if I order them today they're not going to get dispatched until tomorrow anyway so theoretically I could just order them tomorrow because it really probably, if I do it in the morning, isn't really going to make that much of a difference. And I can just do them on my morning break or, or on my lunch or even before I start work.
on, that is like, how do they get away with making shit this heavy? Oh, my tiny womanly arms couldn't handle it. I think I think they're all better with the blue, mm -hmm. but that one I also like with the yellow. Yeah, I do like that one with the yellow. I like the B with the yellow as well. Mm. I think that I think the blue is going to be the worst. Yeah, I think so. What do you think of the size of them? Size? Yeah, good. Yeah. So the, they're like postcard size, right? Yeah, but they're going to be in this finish, so they're going to feel like this. Yeah, nice. No, it's really nice. They're good. Yeah, they're really excellent. They're worth buying. Yeah. 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 And then I think on the back, I'm just going to put like my name and my free icons. You know? So like that. Yeah, yeah, that's it. I mean, without the bit at the bottom. Yeah, of course. Yeah, it's magic. Do you think just my name and the three icons yeah. will be enough? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, it's good. Oh, cool, I can go to bed now. That's nice. Uh, yeah. Hello. Um, it's, fr it's like a week since I last spoke to you. It's Friday. Um, I wasn't going to do this now because um, I'm not wearing any makeup. And my hair's really greasy and my studio's a mess. But my prints came. And I genuinely can't wait any longer to open them. So I'm gonna open them now. Oh my god, please don't look awful. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my god! They actually... They look so nice. And the finish is just beautiful. Oh, they have a blue background. I, I haven't actually edited any of this, so I don't know, I don't remember what I spoke about, but. So the original paintings all had yellow backgrounds like this. Um, and then when I was editing them, I didn't think they looked springy enough. Like the yellow backgrounds was making them look really like, I don't know, late summer, early autumn. And the theme for the gallery is spring. So I just literally went in and changed the color of the black background to blue and it just instantly made them all look nicer. So yeah, they turned out really good. Oh loud. And they've got, I did the little, um, I did my little icons on the back. So yeah, excuse my disgusting face. Oh my God, I'm so happy with them. This is, I think this is my favorite. So pretty. Oh wow, I'm super impressed with these. So I just need to um, get in contact with the girl at the gallery and figure out when I'm going to drop these off and if I need to put them in plastic bags. But yeah, I'm going to actually eat my lunch now and uh, get back to work. So, bye!
So I just got back from Felix to, to drop off the prints at the gallery box and yeah, had a really nice chat with Victoria, the girl who runs it. And yeah, cut my prints on the little whirly gig, the little display stand, and they look super cute. So can't wait to see what happens to them, if people like them or if people buy them. But yeah, it was really fun. I felt very cool, felt very much like a proper artist. <laughs> Which is not to say that you're not a proper artist if you're not displaying anything in galleries. It just made me feel like a proper artist. So yeah, pretty happy. Obviously anything that doesn't sell, I'm going to be selling in my Etsy shop. So if you've seen anything you like, keep an eye out in June. Um, if they do sell really well, I might get some more made and put them in the Etsy shop anyway. We'll see. But yeah, other than that, I'm going to end the vlog here. This was supposed to be a mini vlog, um, but just ended up being a regular size vlog. I haven't even edited this yet and I don't know how long it's going to be but I reckon it's going to be pretty long. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I did. <laughs> if you got this far, leave me the emoji of like, you know the one that's like a, a painting? Leave me that emoji if you got this far. Give us a thumbs up if you liked it. Give us a thumbs up if you didn't like it because that's what nice people do. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And yeah, I'll see you soon for another one. Bye! Also, um, I forgot to tell you to drink your water and eat fruits and vegetables and wear your mask over your nose. So do that as well. Bye!